What's up, guys? It's your boy Darkskin, and today we're going to be going over Indra Otsutsuki Lone War God. Now, like I said in my last video, if you didn't uh, watch that one yet, uh, these both Indra and Ashra are both free. One is from PvP Shop, and one is from Ninja Road Shop. Now, somebody in my comment section was just like, they're not free because you got to grind for them with in-game currency or something. No, listen, the in-game currency is pearls, okay? Anything outside of that isn't the main in-game currency. Now, the reason why he's free is because every single person in the game can get him. Every single person in the game can get him 100%. Both of them. You can get both of them 100%. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's not like you got to spend pearls to get a chance at the RNG god to pull the... No. It's a 100% chance for every single person that does the necessary stuff. It's like LR Goku on Dokkan or any other unit that was farmable. You, it, you, All you have to do is grind and you get the character. Okay? So let's get that out the way. Anyways. Indra. Starting off, my boy is a body unit. Shout out to the body team Cloud Gang. Uh, it says no affiliation, but he's the Senju affiliation. They were just added into the game, Senju and uh, Senju. He's the Uchiha affiliation. I switched those. Um, Senju and Uchiha were added into the game with the update. Uh, call 60, it goes down to 30. Ashura also goes down to 30. I don't think I put that up. Uh, like I said, body team Cloud Gang. Uh, He's a mid-range unit. Uh, he has low HP, but he has really high attack. So, um, in my last video, Ashura is like a defensive support unit. Indra is like a a damage dealer with some defense or something like that, kind of. You know, something. I don't know. Anyways, 11, 24 uh, um, HP, 1658 attack, 23 to 46% chance to counterattack. And boost crit rate by 2.25. Well, which, like, body units have counters and body units have crit. Like, that's that's known now. Though. That's what they do. Um, so there's that. And then, uh, his, ult, his jutsu. For 5 chakra, 3.5 times attack and body damage to one enemy and leaves a black flame region that deals 500 fixed damage every turn for 4 turns for a total of 2,000 damage. Now, uh, this is Amaterasu, and we're going to go ahead and uh, look at it right here. There's that right there. Boom. And then it leaves a flame region, just like uh, Takasasuke's Amaterasu. There's that. So, yeah. And then... Yeah. Okay, so, and then uh, his ultimate... Which is 6.5 times attack and body damage to all enemies in range. 50% chance of immobilized for two turns. You gotta hit three people to get a, a chakra from that. Um, and then obviously, if it's PvP, it's two seconds. And here's the secret technique. Vara? Vajra? I don't know. But yeah, that's AoE. So that's really good long range AOE. Oh, excuse me. Oh my goodness. All right. Yeah. So anyways, going on to his uh, abilities. Reduces damage taken by 5%, which is really good. Obviously, you don't want to take damage. Boost attack by 100, reduces damage by 5. Boost attack by 200, reduces damage by 5. So you're reducing 15% damage, right? Okay. You have a 1958 attack stat, so it's pretty much 2,000, and then an extra pill 100, so you got 2,100 damage, right? You got 2,100 damage with a medium range unit, dog. That's free. Yo, that's nasty. And obviously, his multipliers are small, but that's because, for one thing, he has a high attack stat. And he's free, so they can't give him a fucking seven times multiplier. And then, on top of 3.5 times his attack, he gets 2,000 more damage. Now, they gotta be in there, but you still get it. And then, the other one is 6.5 times. 
Um, it's AOE, and you can immobilize. That's why. That's why the mo- the um, they're not like really big multipliers. If anybody wants to know, um, so yeah, his his abilities are really good. Like I like he's really good. Uh, sync with body reduces chance of being sealed. That's a PVP stat. I mean sync skill. Sync with mid range boost attack by seventy five, which is kind of man because like body, it's like body units are either short range or long range for the most part. They're like short ranged or they're long range. They're not. They're they're nothing else. Like the uh, emergency mission Raikage's medium range. Haku's medium ranged. Uh, I'm trying to think of some, but it's like Killer B Takasasuke third Raikage. Uh, oh, Kimi Maru's medium range, and it's like just a whole, but it's like short range or long range body, like that's it, really. PVP stats: twenty one thousand HP, twenty six hundred PVP um, attack, and then two hundred speed. Which this unit is literally PVE, like that's solely PVE, and the Asha's like PVP mostly, or like half and half, like, you know what I'm saying? So there's that. Um. As far as PvP goes, he's not going to be that useful. Because he's not fast enough to have that low amount of speed. Like, like Hashira, like, not Hashirama. Minato has, like, that much HP bravery. And he has tw- 321 speed. You, you see what I'm saying? So, um, as far as PvP, man. But, I mean, like, he's free. And he's a really good, like, 99 luck unit for your body team if you don't have one. Or, even like, even if you do. Like... I feel like he outranks all other body units for 99 luck. Unless it's like a summonable one. I'm talking about the free ones. Like, Obito beats him. Uh, Because it's like, Obito reduces skill damage, but he reduces all damage. You know what I'm saying? Um, He beats the third Raikage. And the simple fact that... I... I don't know if he beats the third Raikage. Third Raikage healing for 100. And then he's blocking damage. For 4-8 Chakra. I know he beats Obito, though. Obito only... May, o, Obito wins only, like, versus skill. Like, everything else, like, he's just not that good. And he's not a good character in general that, like, people like. Unless you're an Obito fan, then that's different. But anyways, yeah, I feel like he's really good. I might stick him on my team. Because I have Haku on my team right now. But Haku, listen, Haku got, like, 2,000 HP, dog. Like, you better get off Haku. Haku lit. Uh... Oh, by the way, by the way, I've been grinding my butt off, yo, hold on. Your boy already got, you know what I'm saying? Your boy already got, look, that's three dupes there, right? Okay. That's a dupe right there, okay. So your boy already got, you know what I'm saying, four of them, right? And then on top of me having four, your boy is literally 400, like, yeah, 400 away from the fifth dupe. And then I just got to work on the last dupe. I've been grinding my neck off. Now, I might, look, listen, guys, Shisui's lit, right? He's lit and all, but it's like, like, what did I tell you? Boost crit, bro. Body, body use have crit. I think I might get me one at- one Shisui just for just to have him. I'm probably not gonna use Shisui any, so it's like uh, I don't think I want to ultimate him, especially whenever I got now. If the next Ninja Roll comes out and there's Eunice butt cheeks, I'll ultimate Shisui. But as far as this one goes, I might just get one of him, right? I might just get one of him, or I don't. You don't know. I don't know. We got we got two weeks, so I might get him. We'll have to see. Because he's a body unit and he's lit. So I might. I don't know. But anyways. Uh, yeah. So anyways, I, got, I have practically five injures already, okay? And then I can just work on PvP for Ashura. So, uh, yeah. That's going to be up. Ah, that's going to be on it for this video. Be sure to give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. Tell me how you feel. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.